I mean, there are a lot of teams in the AFC that I like better than Tennessee. I think Tennessee is the second best team in the AFC. That's a, and it's a bold statement to okay. say that. And But, but here's the reason why. Wow, and I, 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 if you're in the AFC, you have to compete offensively. Like you have to com like you have to be able to put points up on a massive level. I don't think the Packers are any more worried today that Aaron Rodgers didn't show up than they were on draft weekend or than they will be when he doesn't show up for training camp. This is why they are worried. Aaron Rodgers protects reputations and saves jobs. A 49 point deficit and a beatdown in game two was not going to take you off your talking points, which were always going to be. It ain't about Brooklyn, it it's about the Bucks. You're a fan of hip hop. This is 1990s East Coast versus West Coast uh, 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 beef, man. This is, this is, now they know, like, simple, put a bow on this, and I'm going to come and, and offer some alms, and, and here's an olive branch. No, man. I'm in deep. I told you. I'm in too deep. I can't even see Brooklyn. I can't see them for who they are. I'm seeing the New York LA series that nobody ever predicted in the history of the NBA. Nets Clippers. That's the finals. And people's collective heads will explode. The only Brooklyn team I will acknowledge as champion, the Brooklyn Dodgers. Shout out, Jackie Robinson. <laughs> okay, I'll be honest with you. I'll be honest with you. <laughs> I've already started looking ahead. And no, man, I just don't like, honestly, I just don't like my chances.